So I've been gone from YouTube, from pretty much everything social media related for past week or two. Honestly, the whole reason why is because we had a hurricane come in. I live in Florida, if you guys don't know, and we are in hurricane season. So basically we're going to lose internet. We're going to lose everything. So I was just like, I'm not even going to do any videos right now. I just want to bunker down, maybe buy a few switch games so I can like just survive this fucking insanity. And lo and behold, a hurricane didn't even hit us. So cool waste of a week. Dope. Very dope. But I have missed a lot of news during my time. I know I've, I've been up to date, but I haven't made a video, which kind of pisses me off because I have a lot of thoughts about a lot of things. So we're, if you guys haven't seen the title, we're going to talk about the battle pass, obviously. If you, guys, if you didn't know, I mean, why'd you click here anyways? But we're just going to get straight to it. I hate and like it i hate it and like it at the same time and it's driving me crazy the more i think about it so if you guys don't know what a battle pass is it's basically a leveling scheme where it's like one to 100 and you get stuff from just playing the game a lot of games have done it well and a lot of games have done it wrong from what i've heard fortnite does it really well and from what i've heard from or from what i know from call of duty black ops 4 they do it horrifically wrong. They they do not oh they do not know how to do it. It's they treat that game like it's a free to play and it makes me fucking laugh. But so I'm not talking about battle bomb, you know. I'm not talking about that game. I'm talking about Destiny. Honestly, the battle pass bugs me and all I also kind of like it for a few things, but we'll talk about the negative so far. The reason I kind of don't like it is it promotes a very not toxic, but a divide between free players and premium players that's gonna happen whether we like it or not or it's gonna happen so it's always gonna be like the free players have really no opinion because they're free they're moochers moochers uh, quote unquote and the premium players are what keeps the game alive whatever i think it's stupid i think we're all players so like there should not be a divide hopefully there's no divide um but that's just how i feel about it not only that, but I think it's really scummy. Not only that, but I think it's really scummy that basically we're getting an exotic through the battle pass. I think it's the sniper hand cannon. And it's only available through the battle pass. So if you don't get up to level 25, which granted, I don't think that should be crazy. I don't think that's a crazy ask. Level 25 especially if it acts like how we gain levels now like level 25 i get those like in a week maybe uh, that's a week okay a week's a might might bit much but like i get that like in maybe two weeks maybe so and that's not even counting like the three um rested xp gain levels that you get each week for each character so that's three six nine twelve already with each week so i don't think that's a big ask especially since I play, I play, well, for me, I play a lot. So 25 is easily, easily going to do it. But for a lot of people, level 25 for an exotic hand cannon, especially when level one, uh, like at level one, premium players get it. I think that's a little scummy. I think that's really scummy, actually, because I'm basically just going to have this for nothing. Like I'm not, I didn't do anything for it. I just logged in and I got it. And it's it's even worse when like you really think about like well what if the gun becomes super op like what if next season it's a, it's like a scout rifle that's like imme like just lasers down everything like if you make something that like that op how how can you really defend the battle pass like really i even like even now this exotic is only exclusive to the battle pass from what i've heard how can you defend that when it's like oh no 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 it's fine it's fine it's fine next season they'll get it or it's fine it's fine in six months they'll get it that's still scummy though dog like i like for sure i'm still gonna see it in my collections if i didn't get it or i couldn't play that season cool i'm definitely not gonna be able to get that for six months even though i can see it in my collections like bro this is i saw uh an article not too long ago that explained the battle pass and there's one 
one phrase that he said that just like really clicked with me and it was this deals or this whole shadow keep business just sounds like weaponized fomo and i was like yo fomo if you don't know it's fear of missing out it's basically like oh you must you you have to be there in order to do like get the things or to experience the things like it just feels like weaponized fomo like Bungie's going hard on like the whole you need to be there to experience this x amount of thing x thing and it's just like yo like chill bro like i'm sorry but like i didn't come into destiny to like become a collection horror this and that i came here because it was fun i like the lore i like the shooting mechanics and some friends like this weaponized fomo dog it needs to stop like bro stop chill like relax that's that's my issue with this battle pass is that it feels too much like we're already getting a season that's gonna drop the not only is it gonna drop like the activity of that season but it's gonna drop like exotics for that season for like a sit like what six months or something so it just feels like so much fomo everywhere i'm like bro like you're telling me i who already put i already put like at minimum eight hours a day on this game because well let me rephrase that i put eight hours a day if there's a goal in mind so usually like when i was doing the pvp stuff i would put like 18 to 12 hours a day but there's people who don't have my time there's people who don't have streamers times like i play as much as like if i became a streamer i, I would become a streamer because i play that much but i don't because i'm a fucking moron but it's just not fair it's not fair that oh yeah sorry man you really had to grind those eight hours a day seven days a week like what bro like really like that's just so mm, no like it it rubs me the wrong way it really rubs me the wrong way because when like when destiny wasn't like this when it wasn't weaponized fomo I play like 12 16 hours a day but now that's like weaponized fomo I, I i i barely play like six hours now i'm just like i can't like i can't do it dude i can't I'm, I'm so tired of having to keep up with everything just to have everything like bro oh my that's just where i'm gonna leave it the things i actually do like about it because there there is a few things i do like about it is like i said i play a lot of this game a lot of the time i play minimum eight hours sometimes i go six hours just because i'm ugh, too it's just too much so even with my time i'm gonna benefit a lot from this battle pass because i'm just gonna get levels i'm just gonna keep getting levels and levels and levels like it'll be cool because i'm getting extra stuff for what i'm already doing basically i'm just getting more shit because i play the game that's something i do like i really do like that because it always means i'm expecting something especially since when i'm like right now i'm farming for liar's handshake you can't really farm that unfortunately so it's just kind of like oh hopefully this week i'll get it and did all i did all my activities for my hunter so i'm like all right i guess i'll go to another character went to my warlock immediately got the new exotic from this season and i was like cool 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 that's exactly what i wanted did not want liar's handshake not fuck that did not want that cool cool thanks bungo like it'll be nice to be like cool i'm almost done with the level 20 i guess i'll get this armor even though i think the armor looks mad weak i think uh side tangent let's be real this armor is weak homie i get what you're I, I get what you're trying to do with the armor you're going for the whole yeah vex they uh sit down in one spot so long grass grows and shit i get that i really get that reference but you know what would have been a better like reference for that is if you actually gave us vex armor that would have been cool like imagine the atheon armor but like literally grass growing and shit not glowing and then just like broken down that would have been cool like i feel like that would have been a reskin that not a lot of people would have bitch bitched about because you're bringing back an armor set that was dope as shit so i don't know man i feel like this battle pass has a lot of potential 
I just worry that this is Bungie's kind of Eververse moment where they're introducing something and they're going to push it too much and they're going to be like, all right, cool, cool, cool. We, we're not going to push it that much, but they're going to move the line just a little bit more. They're going to move it just a little bit more to the point where it's like, oh yeah, the battle pass, you got to pay extra for it. Uh, it has three exotics out of the four exotics that you can get in this new season and you can buy each uh, level for two dollars and like just immediately like yo whoa like what like i would not pa put it past them especially since the casual market is literally everything like that's honestly it's casuals casuals it's all your fault i'm sorry it's casuals and whales so you know it's it's not cool it's not cool i don't like spending x amount of money on a game and then get a battle pass and it's like cool so you can uh play play the game like you usually do and mooch off us off of us or you can support us even though we make a bunch of money already by spending money on the battle pass to get the stuff and then you can either level up or you can just spend two dollars on a level and it's like what it's like it's two hundred dollars for for the whole thing it's like yeah yeah yeah, yeah. but like you're, you're supporting us it's like what the fuck so that those are my thoughts i like it and i hate it at the same time i like it note how i said i didn't love it i like it so i hate it more than i like it so that's how i feel about it sorry if this was a little like less professional or less uh if you heard a lot of so's and ums because this was live i all these videos are going to be live because I want to show you my raw, raw thoughts on them. I don't want to like articulate my thoughts. I really want you guys just to see like, just like, you know what? Fuck that. Like, I want to, I want you to see that. So I'll see you guys later. Let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think I'm a little bit paranoid? Do you guys like the battle pass? Do you think I'm just being stupid? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on my social media outlets. Links are in the description below and I will see you guys later.